smoke weed every day. I had to add that in. <clears throat> right, so welcome, welcome to another video. Uh, once again, voiceover. Hope uh, no one's getting bored, but if you are, you can switch it off. So. <laughs> Uh, now this video contains highlights, mostly slots, from two different sessions. Um, uh, one of them on the 7th of June 2020 and the other 8th of June. Yeah, I will wins. say uh, when, as well as you can see in the bottom right, we're on the yeah 7th of June, almost 6 in the morning, and I'm playing this Caribbean Draw Poker again. Player wins. <coughs> A game I was dabbling in last year um, just because that progressive looked very tasty I know the odds are like what is it 600 odd thousand to one and you have to put a one pound uh, chip down so yeah it sort of becomes a plus EV uh, when it gets to uh, well whatever the odds is 600 odd something thousand to one so the progressive gets sorry if the <laughs> Calm down, let's have a sip of beer. Estrella this time. High card. Player wins. <clears throat> Perhaps I need a joint. Um yeah, so when the progressive gets like obviously seven or eight hundred thousand, it becomes in your favour really, but yeah. The chances of hitting that is ridiculous. Plus you've got a bet on the actual game as well, so actually I guess it doesn't go in your favour. I'm talking crap once again. Basically, if you're looking to win the progressive Wishful thinking because you have to get extremely lucky. But it is an interesting game, to be honest. Uh, not one you really see anyone play. Um, I don't know the correct strategy for getting rid of the two cards. I'm not like 100% optimal, obviously, but uh, I was probably having a few jars playing this, and I think there's a hit coming up. So, yeah. Um, this is going to be like a sort of yeah slots Player highlight wins. compilation. Player wins bonus. Got three tens there, and we're drawing to hit another ten, a beautiful four of a kind, and the dealer qualifies oh, with man. two kings. Player Look wins. at that grand chip, bang! Yep. Of course, I have to sit there and take that in for a bit. You know, it's a nice hit. I'm moving the mouse. Yep. They're, they're the nice hits on this game. I've never actually had a straight flush, but I've had four rekind three or four times now. It's a nice surprise. So, bloody bitch though if the uh, dealer doesn't qualify. That's the, on that's the only harsh thing about this game, is when you've got something decent and the dealer doesn't qualify. Uh, player wins. Really, really annoying. So I'm working out what to change there. <laughs> High card. Player wins. And uh, I think after this video, there's going to be some live stream highlights. So I won't need to do any uh, voiceover for that because I would have been talking on the live stream. I still have some old live streams saved that I haven't gone through, you know, some losses, some wins. Uh, yeah, I'll get them on. Player wins. As I keep saying, I want to get all the sort of recordings that I have done out of the way. I don't know why I've taken so long to put them on. I guess just lack of inspiration. I was probably too busy gambling and doing other things. Uh, yeah, just... I, I, I don't think I could ever be one to upload like every day or every two days or be like very consistent. It just, I don't know. I, I've had phases of uploading quite a lot, but yeah. I'm going through them now. It's actually, like I say, it's quite enjoyable to watch them back uh, without the sort of stress. Player 
Japan. Player wins. Estrella, Barcelona. It's a nice lager. Pan. Player wins. I need to give up the lager though. God, my stomach. That's like a balloon. I looked in the mirror and I was like, are you serious? Like, I haven't done any exercise in, like, months now. <laughs> oh, the dealer! <gasps> the dealer got a royal flush. I, I honestly... Bets, please. Whoa. I swear I'm alive. I can't remember that happening. <laughs> that was a complete surprise. I just saw the four and I was like, what the fuck? Dealer drew to royal flush there. I don't know what the odds are when you draw to it. Obviously, to get it straight away, it's like six hundred or thousand to one. But to draw to it, I don't know. I don't know the actual odds then. Maybe some of the chat will know. Uh, in, in the chat, in the comments, you know who's watching. Um, obviously, maybe a quick Google search. I don't know how you search that. The Caribbean draw odds of getting the Royal Flush with the draw has to be this version as well. Uh, wow, I didn't notice that. That's amazing. Shame there wasn't a little pot if the dealer gets it. Wow. Anyway, what was I was saying, yeah, I look, yeah, I just, I need to get, do some exercise. Um, just waiting for the weather to get a bit better. I need to get, I need to, the stomach needs to go down. Too much beer, fast foods, breakfasts. <laughs> uh, oh dear. Comments on that breakfast video made me laugh, though, some of them. <laughs> uh, yeah. Just a bit of fun, innit? A bit of a laugh. Hey, 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 hey. Smoke weed every day, 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 day. Smoke, smoke, smoke weed every day. Straight. Player wins. Straight. So I'm not actually looking at the screen. Right, what's going on? Oh, 1100 the bounce. That's how quick it can go back. And I will tell you the end result for these two sessions at the end of the video. Uh, or you yeah, may be able to work it out. Like I say, this is... Um, I was playing Primal before this. Clearly I lost the balance. So I probably put 500 on here. I think that was my limit at the time, 500. Um, Two pair. Player wins. Player wins. Gambling at six in the morning. Christ. It's pretty bad. I, I sleep to like probably three or four in the afternoon, and then, oh man, these were some long old sessions. Got to be up reasonably early tomorrow. Um, got a couple of deliveries. Right, next clip. Mega Moolah jackpot bonus. Uh, the bounce has gone down to 540. It's now 20 past six in the morning. You know, I always think of these these chances on the jackpot wheel. You never know, dear. You never know. But I really wish the mini was bigger. But it lands so often. Mega Moolah, Mega Moolah. But this time it was a minor. Do you like this music? Drums, you know. Fucking hell, 100 quid away! Yeah, I, if you look on YouTube, they do like a demo. Um, oh, I got the free spins as well, and a trigger. They show you what it would look like if you won the progressive. It actually has its own unique music. Yeah. Wouldn't mind that in front of the screen, you know. You have won 4 million. 4.2 million. 
Going with the 420 theme on this vid. Oh dear, look at the bounce. Oh god. Oh, it's, all, oh, it's still there. Oh no. Ugh. Go away. Go. Please go. Oh, there we go. It's much nicer now. Fun fact, as I guess a lot of people know, yeah. Never believed it when I first heard about it. Add up all the numbers on the roulette wheel. I'm like, wow. <laughs> okay. Is that deliberate? This game, honestly. I know the RTP is 88%, but it's easy to bonus. The jackpot wheel is a bit of a novelty. And it's probably one of the first sort of video slots I played regularly back in 2009, maybe. I'd always play this. I used to get an absolute buzz when I hit the free spins. Hey, we're on the old five reel drive now. So you just don't see these games anymore. People are like, yeah, because they're shit. Well, it's old school, isn't it? You know, it's... I like a bit of old school. A bit of nostalgia. You know, they're not games I play all day. I'll leave that to the really high variant stuff and never win on it. <laughs> yeah, like the mini shit, like tenor, what's the point of that? Right, so I lost this balance, because I can now see the next clip. I lost that. I probably put 200 on this site. Um, and for some reason I'm on Dreamcatcher, don't know why. Don't really like the game. I think I saw the numbers, I was like, I'll oh, go on then. Like, you know, just ones, twos, and fives. You know, you think it's due. She's, I swear she's got the old crazy time out here, hasn't She's quite loud, it's actually. I need to turn my volume down my end. Probably going back in the mic. And ladies and Is that a 20, ladies and gentlemen? Woo, baby, oh. we got it! So early in the session over here. Congratulations. If only I had the balls to put more money on. Yes. But then it would probably lost. Yes. We got it. Oh, she's having a dance. We got it. Yep. So enjoy, guys. Yes, I'm super happy for this one and for seeing the game. So final seconds. Oh, a warm hello there. Stop dancing. I'm crying. Someone says. Had a nice lovely day to see you every day. Oh, you are so sweet, warm. I'm doing super good. Thank you for asking. Had an amazing previous session. So right now I'm here, determined to get another one like that. So, you know, just stay around, enjoy the session. How is your Sunday? Stop dancing, I'm crying. Good, that's exactly what I'm here she for. To like entertain you guys. That's exactly why this dance is for. My little sister actually is also uh, uh, like uh, smiling and laughing when I'm doing this move, this dancing. Oh right, <laughs> anyway. Um... Uh, on to Razor Shark. Hit a bunch of coins on a five pound bit. Um. But not much. Yeah, it's uh, 10 to 8 in the morning. Trying to work out where we are. Okay, I think looking judging by the look of this, I also lost this balance. The reality. 
Um, it's now okay. It's now next day, so that was the end of the session. Didn't win. I just yeah. Any bounce was spaffed there. Uh, look at the log for June. You'll see after the 35k Jack and the Beanstalk win that I was there was losses. So this corresponds. That's right. It's hard to remember. It's now half five in the morning. Next day, 8th of June, and we're back on the micro gaming. On uh, Mortal Romance, one of the best soundtracks for any bonus. I'm sorry you can't hear it very well, but I can turn the volume down. What a shit bonus that was. Wow. Once again, the reality of slot. On a six pound, ugh. Yeah, I wasn't happy with that one. And we're on another site, so I lost that balance previously. So yeah, that would have been a 500 deposit, which I lost. So, new site. Uh, I'd have put, I, I know what I'd done on here. I'd, I'd put 500 on and started with 10 pound bets straight off the bat. Yeah, because I am now um, blocked from this group and this site. As I mentioned on a previous video, as you can see, the, lo the logo is covered over as well. Uh, source of wealth checks, and I couldn't be bothered. I really couldn't be bothered. There was other sites of playing, and I was just like, no, I'm not interested really. Like, just I should have the limits lowered, really. I did lose a fair few thousand on this site, though. So maybe that's what triggered it. Yeah, this is kind of my strategy, just like deposit and punt it. I mean, I wouldn't recommend it. Just, it just makes the variance very crazy high, you know. Ten pound bet gets, gets you fifty spins in it, you know. It's, and I don't have the balls to like go on roulette and just do like ten fifty pound numbers, which would then give eighteen hundred and then go for it, like. Because I, I, I did want a bit of like, I wanted a bit of entertainment as well, I guess, you know, I don't want to just, the one spin it's gone, but that's probably what I should have done. Give you a better chance. Not that you should be putting on them kind of amounts. Depends what your budget is, I suppose. That'll all be over soon, I reckon. Cap steak's coming. As I spoke about in the previous video. If it does come in, it'll be interesting because it's sort of like, well, it won't be interesting in the in, for the sake of general YouTube casino content, but for the UK uh, players, it does then put everyone on a level playing field, doesn't it? But I, I also feel it's just like a, it's going to be a slow drain because, like, like I say, if you do have the discipline, you put a small deposit on or whatever your amount is, you know, and you build it up, then you increase the stakes. There's a chance of you actually hitting the big one uh, from the casino, whereas if you're, if you're capped on the stakes, they're going to love that because it's then a slow drain. You can never really go for it, can you? But I can also see many uh, positives for having a cap for majority of players, obviously. At least there won't be a cap on the win, you know, so like two pound steak online can go do lally can't it still you know depends what game it is whereas if you're playing an arcade or something or it's it's 500 pound max 250x you know it's you know you have to hit multiple jackpots to actually get a big balance but some of these games now like they'll go a few thousand x online don't they you know it's mad that bloody san what was it san quinton 150,000x? Like, I know that's probably like hitting a lottery win, but. But my biggest stake to win is Primal, so that's 4,000x. £3, so yeah, cut that down to £2, eight grand. Huh, I wouldn't, I wouldn't moan. 8k, get in there. That'll do. And obviously, that's not the biggest it can do, I guess.
So yeah, I mean, look at um, uh, Bandit's uh, six pounder on Jam and Jars, was it? Or was it over a hundred thousand? I don't know what stake to win those. I can't really. Uh, what's that? Over 15, 15, 16,000 x is it? Something like that, is it? Oh no, I can, I can work it out. Can I? No, can I? I don't know. <laughs> I'll give up. Uh, honestly, when, whenever I think about maths, my brain just—I swear it just like corrupts. Uh, a lot of coins here. Uh, on Razor Shark, uh, I believe we are on another new site. Yes, so I lost that previous 500 after the Flame Busters bonus. Oh, we've got a hundred coin there as well, and a 50. This is a nice hit. Yeah, I think I think he hit about 16,000 x, which is insane. I didn't even know that game could do that. I think he was as shocked as everyone. Anyway, uh, Razor Shark. Yeah, good start on Razor Shark. Uh, this game, honestly, it's uh, mental. Um, I've played this game quite a lot. Oh, that's good. Four x. I remember when, on my video when I spoke about my loss, um, I said I was playing Razor Shark at £100 a spin, £50 a spin. And when someone in the comments was like, oh my god, Razor Shark for fuck's sake, like as if why were you playing that? Ironically, I actually made money on it. I, I hit like the 100 coin um, straight away. For, like It just popped up like 10 grand. I was like, fucking hell, man. I really wanted to hit like something huge on it, but obviously. It didn't happen, but yeah, you'll see the footage of that at some point. That's just, that is pretty silly betting that kind of money on this game, I know, but it, it, it wasn't actually like, I was act, I actually won off it, like, <laughs> but then I lost it, obviously, on another game, or games. That, but yeah, a lot of sites really cap you on this game. They don't let you do them sort of bets, which is, yeah, a good thing, I guess. Um, I've even seen as low as like two pounds spin, uh, or maybe even 120. That, that San Quentin game on a site I was on the other day, £1.20 was the max. So yeah, some casinos are uh, restricting your your bet anyway because they don't want to they don't want to have to pay out the big the big chunks. They just want everyone to be like flat betting, so they can never lose really long term. But they they can't lose long term anyway. But I don't think they like hit and run players because. Obviously, uh, with all the fines now as well for uh, source of wealth, I won't say which casino it was. Um, it's considered quite reputable in the space, so I signed up with it. I put on ten thousand and won twenty-two grand, and they asked for source of funds after I'd won. So I sent it. And then they asked for another thing, and I was like, "Okay, here have that, have that as well." And then they were like, okay, your withdrawal is now going to be processed. Next time, they, they processed it. Next time I logged in, this account has been banned. I was like, what? So they didn't like it. You know, they didn't like the fact that you come on, you punt it, you hit it, you run. They don't, they don't want that. I think the casinos just want the, you know, flat betters. He'll spin all day, not not sorry, not all day, you know what I mean. He'll spin a lot on the same game, the same stakes, and the RTP will eventually catch up with them. They, they can't lose, really, can they? That's the problem. If a high roller comes along, yeah, they can lose a lot, but with the obviously the rules now, the regs, they have to check all the funds, um, and they've got the risk of being fined, so they don't want that kind of play now, I don't think. Because, yeah, it's... If someone comes on with 10 grand and wins 60, that's soaking up so many other players who just play like really casually, you know. Uh, whether anyone agrees or disagrees with that. But that's fine, that's some saying like sort of, I'm guessing, I'm just seeing maybe where they're coming from, I don't know. Anyway, Bruce Lee, what a game. Uh, 11 pounds, 10 stake. I think we're actually on another different site. Yes, we are, because I can tell by the menu at the top. 
half six in the morning. Yeah, I was losing all these bounces because I just had the Jack and the Beanstalk when I was just like, like I want to hit another five or ten grand here or something, you know, I was just going for it. Like ten pound stake without bounce. <sighs> Very hit or miss, isn't it? Gotta love that music though. This this is one of those classic WMS slots. Just love that add-up. I've only had the double feature once and it was like pretty much one of the first times I played this game. Um, it was a, I think it was a 60p stake and it paid like 1000x. Wasn't the best symbols. This is a game I'd love to like see more people play and try and go for that double feature. But it's just considered a bit old now this game isn't it. Shame. WMS always. Rem I never. I was never part of it, but I used to watch videos of it. Was it Jackpot Party? They had those progressives. They, that seemed really like fair sight. That did like with the progressives. I can't. I think it's called Jackpot Party. Then it got bought out. I won't name who bought it or the site it's now called now, but yeah, it's basically turned to shit, isn't it? They got rid of that feature. I don't know why they got rid of it. Like, they had a chat room and that and everything. They're like people could see who was winning it and that. It's another bonus hit. So I'm talking too much. Let's let's watch the slots. For Shit, it's not recording though. No. Thank God. <laughs> Magnificent. Magnificent. I had a couple of turkey burgers uh, earlier. A bit mushy. Uh, not like frozen ones, like, you know, chilled fresh ones, but yeah, I, did, mm, I put them under the grill, they like inflated like fucking Yorkshire puddings or something, I was like, what the fuck? So my guts were playing me up a bit, but now I've had some of this beer, it's kind of calmed down a bit. Oh, I've left the music on, look. Oh, sorry, just turned it up my end. thought the music was still going. There's a nice bonus. Got, got to turn up the add up. It might sound a bit weird because it's probably going through the microphone there, but yeah. So the balance, 2,700, I'm thinking, hello, hello. We can really turn this into something, so guess what's coming up? Oh, it's 40 pound spins on Dragonborn. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> and it came in pretty quick by the looks of it, looking at the balance. Yeah, one of BTG's early ones, obviously. Apparently it can go huge, but I've never had it go huge. I've had 100x, maybe 150x, but yeah. I don't really play it religiously. Never did. I always found the bonus to be a little bit sneaky. So £40 bets. We've got just over 2x. Seven X and that's your lot, mate. Jog on. Enjoy. Yeah, disappointing. Uh, I lower the stake here by the looks of it. Um, how many minutes has passed till the next clip? What does it say? 6.43 and it's now 6.48. So we have a bonus on a tenner. I've lowered it. Balance 1,200. In a few minutes the balance has gone down like five or 600 quid. Yeah, I was 
really trying to prolong the high from the Jack and the Bean, weren't I? I do like how you get one spin for another diamond there, that's always gives you that extra chance which never comes in. <laughs> I mean, look, ten pound stake, six x. Oh my god! Oh no, it's a bit more. Thirteen x, thirteen and a half x. Yeah. Oh my god! If anyone saw um. Roller finally hit on the little, little devil. Fucking finally hit on it, didn't he? I think he said he, he worked out he's about 60k in. Oh, and I believe him because I've watched his. <laughs> them build ups take fucking ages and on them stakes. Oh my gosh. I mean, I've, tried, I've, built, I've built them up twice but on much lower stakes. But yeah. Um, watching that live, I was like, fucking get in there, man. Oh, if it, if it re triggered again, though. Ooh. But yeah, that was a that was a nice touch for him. Little devil. Yeah, it's such a fucking that game, honestly. And your Dragonfall, this is a game I like. I actually prefer this over Jam and Jars, even though I've had a crazy win on Jam and Jars, which actually got featured on Casino Grounds once, on their. twice, on one of their uh, wins of the week, and then. Uh, what do you call it? Um, da -da 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 -da, uh, top 10 Jam and Jars wins. It's like, get in there. And I think the Star Quest one went on there. But yeah, it's not often a. Uh, Not often I can make it on the old CG. <laughs> I suppose the Jack and the Bean is a bit uh, a bit late as well, isn't it? A bit too late for that to go on. And the, haven't they done the wins of 2020 now? But yeah, I, I I pretty much skim them videos. Uh, I'll, I'll basically click on their videos now and then, and if it's a game I'm interested in, I'll watch the hit. Um. Oh, there's a community one I saw as well, uh, Sparta Cash Megaways. I've been playing that a bit. Fucking hell, that's high variance. Oh my god. I've had like maybe five bonuses on it, and they've been absolutely dire, and that is because it is so high variance. But it's a game that really wouldn't annoy me, because um, like Rage and Rhino Mega Ways, I really tried to give that a good go. I did actually have a bit of a hit on that actually, which I'll upload at some point as part of some footage I got last year, which I haven't got round to yet, because this is before it. Um, yeah, uh, da -da -da -da. Um, but yeah, that was a game like I was grinding a bit, but I think I could... There's some games that don't annoy me to grind them out, because like, I know it'll come eventually. You'll get something back, or you'll make a slight profit. Um, more often than not, you'll get something back, not the profit, but... Yeah, just, just the way the game flows, and the music, and you know, some some games... Like Bonanza, I could not grind Bonanza, the fucking music would do my head in. Uh, but like Primal, as we're on now, like, yeah, this is a game I can play. Uh, I fucking did as well, didn't I? I chased it like crazy. I was like eight grand in for eventually twelve out, which was probably incredibly lucky. After kind of being inspired by someone's hit, uh, yeah, I felt like an idiot when I was session after session playing this game and losing, and then finally that just went boom, twelve k. We've got another ten spins here. Uh, this is another site as well, so I've lost the balance again, I think. 
like I said, these are all just slot hits that I was recording but weren't commentating on. Just because I was playing solo, you know. You know. <laughs> My niece got this from Shackleton's, you know. <laughs> Can't believe someone commented that on that, that video I'd done in the shed. It was brilliant. I thought, brilliant. I, I linked back the um, Top Gear. Um, uh, what was it? Is it like they were doing the old people's car? Do you put in Top Gear old people's car or Top Gear Shackleton's? Shackleton's high seat. Um, yeah, <laughs> you knew. <laughs> uh, some of the comments do make me laugh. Oh, we've got extra spins on this one. Two pound stake. Not much balance left. Where's the advert? Hang on. Shackleton's high seat. It's grand to find a comfortable chair when you're getting on a bit or you've got arthritis. My niece got this from Shackleton's, you know. Shackleton's <laughs> original high seat. Never thought it'd be so easy to get in and out of. First she sent for their brochure. Then went to the showrooms. Made over a hundred chairs to choose from. Shackleton's high seat chair. It's lovely. It's lovely. And I've got one in the shed. <laughs> oh, we'll have when I move. It's lovely. Yeah, I don't mind an old old person. Uh, you know, like the uh, sort of old chairs. You know, the, the chair you sort of go around your, your grannies or whatever. Say my uh, yeah, one of my grannies is still alive, and. One of my nans is still alive. Actually, that's no weird thing to know that. Wow. You're not here long, are you? You're not here long. Well, no, she... Um, one of my granddads didn't have a long... Well, he's sort of 54, so I wouldn't really consider that a long life. It'd gone too early, but my uh, other nan, she was in her 80s, so she'd had, she had a long life. Um... Yeah, it's mad, isn't it? Sorry, not to be dark there, I just... Oh. hate it when something like that brushes past the mine, it's like, oh, it's nice. Right, change the subject. <laughs> change the subject. Okay, Primal. Uh, 20 spins used, 30 left. Mammoth win. But no, I hope yeah, I hope everyone everyone's family's well and uh, if there is any bad things going on in life, you know, it's it's life and that's the problem. You just be strong. Uh, think of good memories. If loved ones have departed. Photos, you've got photos. What's it all for? I don't know. Just to live a worthwhile life, have a bit of fun, and uh, yeah. As long as you've had a bit of fun in your life, you know, it's you've done things, you know. It's like my dream was, like I say, it was always to move out from the parents, and I'd done that. And thank God, thank the Lord. <laughs> oh God, if I was there now, oh dear. Once again, not that I don't like my family, but oh, just no, 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 no. I'm just the day I moved out. Well, it didn't sink in it straight away. Well, it actually did sink in the day. I, one of the first nights I had at the flat, I didn't even have a bed, right? I just had my computer and the internet and a sofa there. 
and I was I fucking cranked that music up for a good two or three hours and got absolutely smashed on Special Brew. <laughs> Regretted it in the morning because I was hungover as fuck, but yeah, those speakers were on full volume. I was fucking partying by myself. I was like, I've got a flat. This is the best thing ever. <laughs> No more being quiet at night. I can do what I want, when I want. Don't have to worry about going to the bathroom and someone's already in there. Just little things. Yup. Loving it. Oh dear. I'm so grateful for that. <sighs> This is a long old bonus on this game. So I've, I've literally just been absolutely waffling on this one and I, I haven't really been paying attention to what's going on the screen. It's just... Consider this more of a, a chat. Oh, it's re-triggered again. Wow, 43 minutes into the video, hour long. Yeah, by looking at the log last year, I'm probably about three or four thousand pounds in for these two sessions. And so far, we haven't made a single cash out. Because I've been going for it. As you've seen, the stakes have been going sort of up and down on this one. With, with multiple deposits. I obviously wasn't in the mood for putting on a big chunk on a new site. Because, uh, yeah, just I must have had some sort of sensible hat on me. Plus, like I said, I did buy something with that 35k win, so... Yeah, maybe there wasn't the, uh... It didn't feel right to, you know, chuck that kind of money on. Maybe I just thought it wouldn't happen again. Like, it, it, it'll probably really... Yeah, just... It'll, I, I, maybe I just felt it would have just lost straight away, I don't know. That is a funny movie, isn't it? Lie, lie. It's a really funny movie. <clears throat> a case is simply this. <laughs> boo, boo. Mm. <laughs> right, so we're on uh, Blackjack. I guess I lost the previous bounce as well. 
500 on here and guess what this site has also banned me and what was really interesting at the time I remember I've been on this site since like like I'm talking 2008 you know 2009 2008 something like that never had any problems and then I started um going on the tables I think I've mentioned this before and the dealers and even the roulette dealers on the exclusive tables were like because my username you can see there it's not like hype or anything because obviously this this before this is way back you know when I made this account before I even was really doing anything with the channel like years before and they were like oh it's the, the I come on they go oh it's the streamer oh hi and all this and then like one got one person got like really embarrassed like oh am I being filmed so I don't know if it came up on their system or word got about that they've they've they'd seen some of my videos with this username obviously on the channel. Um, so I was like, okay, this is kind of a bit odd. And then yeah, like all of all of a sudden, uh, uh, got an actual real personalised email saying we need to do a source of funds checks. So I was like, okay. Um, and they asked for a couple of things. I sent it. This this is what's really sneaky about these checks sometimes when you're doing big bets. They ask you for like a couple of things. They're like, right, we'll just process them. You don't hear anything for a couple of days. They come back, oh, we just need this now. And you're like, okay, go on then, have that. Because I actually like playing on this site. They like the site. They had a lot of exclusives. They paid out really quick. Um, once again, all casino is bad. They take your money. But, you know, there's better ones than others in there. You do like a punt. So send another thing off, they come back and they're like, we want this. I was like, are you serious? Like, why do you need that? It's just like, I, I said to them, I said, I'm, I'm not sending that. And then I got an email back saying, oh, you're well within your right not to send it. Um, we're now going to close your account and feel free to contact us again um, if you want to be reinstated. I was like, oh, whatever. But anyway, what happened was... Uh, probably about four or five months after that, I did send them an email to say, look, um, I still have a sports bet on there, uh, which is, I don't know the result of it. Can I like log into my account or can you possibly assist me of getting my account reinstated? Never heard anything, so that was that. So yeah, I could no longer play on Willie Hill as much as I'd love to, because uh, I actually really liked playing him. I used to have a lot of luck here, to be honest. But yeah, this is, I'm also blocked from here now, so. That was that. So just playing a bit of blackjack. Sorry if the quiet's a bit low for the dealer, but they're not really saying anything interesting anyway. They're just sort of mumbling, you know, these dealers are like, so what do you want to hit on the old, old 17 then? I'm split on that one, sir, and uh, oh, we've got 20, 21. I give it the game next game. Yeah, it's all gibberish half the time, and it's just we won there. So yeah, it's a bit shit that I'm blocked from this. It's like you're blocked for life, and it's like for just playing. You know, it's like what? I even had a phone call with them as well. That's what really weird. I had a phone call, and they were like, "Are you keeping in control because of the?" virus last year you know um and well what's you know still going on and I, I i forget it's going on half the time i literally don't watch any news on it I, i'm really not interested now like you know i stay at home i go out and do my shopping i come back i'll go out for a drive now and then i don't mix households you know it's like um i mean it's just i don't i don't have a clue what's going on at the minute but uh yeah they were asking about that like is your income all right? Can you afford to do this? I'm like, it's, it's a strange thing to ask after I've been playing on here for 10 years. Like, so I'm sitting there like saying all the right things. I'm like, yes, yes. Oh yes, I know about the deposit limits. Oh yes, yes, I'm in control. Yes, if I needed to, I'll take a time out. And she was like, okay, that's fine. Okay, we'll get your account reinstated. And then I got asked for all the source of funds. I was just like, oh, this is just really. So that was that, yeah. So, 
We've got 21, we're hitting 16. Dealer has 12. 15. Bust. Ka-ching. Nice little bounce booster there. I've not been talking a bit too much on this one. Feel free to say it because I have literally just been, my mouth has been running in it. <laughs> oh. Why I, it's like I'm doing this at half eleven, isn't it? I've got, got to be up fairly early. Say early, I have to be up about half ten. I know that's not early. I know. Eight hands in a row, look. Eight hands in a row on the direct middle seat. Nine of diamonds, nine of diamonds. Oh. oh, 11 though, double. The double, double. We'll do the double. Twenty and twenty one. And the dealer has eighteen. Both seats wins. We've now got nine in a row. Oh it it's done like stars as well. Nine hands in a row. What's the highest anyone's seen? I'd love to get eleven hands in a row. I think I played a session on Blackjack Party where I got a lot in a row. Don't know if I've uploaded that or not. I don't think I have, actually. I think that's one of the future vids to come. Would you like insurance? Obviously, I'm praying for the 10 in a row here. Just It's all about the wins in a row now, isn't it? But he's got blackjack. So, as I can see on my software, I'm like, fuck this, I'm off. Bounce 1166. And guess what game I go on? Oh, old school Cleopatra. Three pound bet, balance eight seventy. I can't see the time on the screen. It's somewhere, but yeah, this is old school game. Once again, now banned from this site. I don't know if they have this version anywhere else, but. This version played well quick compared to like the sort of more modernized IGT version. I know this is the same sort of game, but... Enjoy your rewards. Share my fantasy. Something about this game. It's just, this is, this is old school, this game. Only good though if you get a fiber kind with a wild. Or if you get read triggers, I think that's cool. Du, 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 du. That's a shit bonus. Treasures are yours. Treasures are mine. Twenty-five quid, thanks. We're still. Look how quick it spins this one. Oh, well, we hit it again. Bounces one thousand. Triple all wins. Triple all wins. Do you know what I really miss Cleopatra 2? Why did they not convert that to HTML5? I really like that game. 
graphics, sounds, the potential of the 50X. I actually reached 50X once, it was a very nice bonus. Low stake, it was like years and years ago, I think I was on like 60p. But it paid a lot, a few hundred. But it do so many dead spins, it's really just such a weird game. Yeah, 96. I wish you great prosperity. Prosperity. So balance 1100. What's the balance going to be next? I've upped the bet here. Six pound. Right. So I don't know what happened, but the balance is now 211. So I haven't cashed out anything. All these clips, there was not a single cash out. A prox free 4,000 loss, 500 deposits, etc. If you talk, you can probably see where the sites were jumped. So, this is a losing video, guys, and this shows the bonuses I was hitting and I was going for it, and yeah, it just didn't happen, did it? So, this one's a loser, but. It was like a highlighted loser. Um, I was showing you the bonuses and yeah, but I don't. I think I probably got involved, so I was like a thousand in after maybe the fourth, or fifth clip. Then I'm kind of locked in. I want three, four, five, six, or at least I did then, you know. So uh, yeah, just to finally say, um, thanks for watching. I think you can probably guess guess what's going to happen here by the length of the video. Uh, the next two or three videos will be highlights of live streams I've done, um, providing if I go through oh, Snaggy19, providing if I go through them I find number it sort of entertaining to put together whatever it's happened on it. If it's just complete dead there's no point in putting it on because I've already done the log anyway which will show that loss and yeah. No one wants to see just dead spins, but there's a bunch of bonuses nice and that, and some bit of banter, maybe, I don't know. And then, yeah, I'll see what's next, and then that lost video will come, but... Yeah, I'll do some recent stuff uh, when I can, and I may even maybe do a cheeky live stream. I'm, I'm thinking about it, you know, I'm thinking about it, but... For now, I hope uh, if anyone did get this far, they've enjoyed it and enjoying these videos. Obviously there's many channels you can watch out there, but I do appreciate anyone that does watch my videos. It's, uh, it's I just, you know, I appreciate all followers, comments and views as always. So, like I say, this is, yeah, sort of the reality of slots, but, you know, I've had hits here, but I wasn't up, so, and you've seen some snaky bonuses, so, yeah. Anyway, bounce zero, no cash outs. So thanks for watching again. You look after yourself, guys. Number look after yourself, guys. Left. And uh, until next time, I'll see you when I see you. Over and out.